there are two formulas that allow you to extract unique distinct values and the source has blank cells and the first uh, array formula is smaller than the second one but the first formula needs to have the header cell cell uh, blank and if you don't want it blank you have to use the second formula here so let's begin with the first formula you need to change the cell references here at least one uh, this cell reference must point to the cell range that has your data and the first argument in the county function must point to this the cell right above your current cell and that's it press enter and then simply click and hold on the black dot and drag to cells below as far as needed and the blanks are not here they are ignored so how does this formula work first i want first i want you to understand that if i use a cell reference to this cell range here and enter it as an array formula and extend the cell range you can see now that the blanks here return a zero and for this formula here to work it needs to have these cells blank in the array and to do that you have to use the ampersand to append a blank like this and now look what happens there is now a blank cell here in the array and that is what we want so if I now use the counter function here with the ampersand and the blank and it's pointing to the cell right above the, this cell range here and the county function returns this array and since it's pointing to a blank cell up here the first value that it counts in this cell range here is the blank cell and since the second argument the cell reference here uh, uses an ampersand to append values to this cell range it returns this array so now the county function counts how many times there are a blank cell in this cell range here so the array returns one for this position and one for this position the next thing the next thing to do is to check if each value in this array is equal to zero and since this is a logical expression it will return true or false
and then the formula divides one with the formula so far and true is one and false is zero so this formula returns an error because one divided by zero is not possible and the lookup function ignores errors in an array and uh, it finds the since all values here are one except these two the lookup value returns the last one or matches the last one and returns the corresponding value so this is what happens and you don't need to enter this as an array formula and the first value in this cell is the same as this cell here so the lookup function looks for number two here and it finds it matches two with the last value that is not an error and this works because all these values are one so they don't need to be sorted the second formula here is almost like the first formula except that it uses another expression logical expression to filter out blank cells so if the values in cell range b3 to b21 this cell range here is equal to a blank and it is here and here it returns one so the array from the county function and this logical expression is added and if the array the value in the array is equal to zero it is this returns true but it won't re, but it won't be equal to zero if there is a blank so that will make these cells false and they return an error when you divide one with false so this formula here ignores blank values